Uh, okay, so I'll just walk you over through the incident that I'm currently working. Okay, how to. Just one second. Yeah. Okay, sure. So yes, currently this incident says that um, the billing rep, can you see my screen? Uh, is it clear? Yeah, yeah. Uh, is it clear now? Yeah, so the billing rep is unable to approve or reject an activity for write-off approval processed by a customer service rep, uh, account servicing group. He is in the role of account servicing group, customer service. Account okay. serving rule has authority limits of $25 for write-off. A request over the amount would be sent to the billing activity queue to be approved or rejected. Okay. So when the activity is approved or our rejected an error is occurring, user, uh, this is the yeah customer service rep who user, is not so having the permission. Our website to send notification when you request activity own permission. Okay. He does not have the permission to own the activity. So ideally, he should be able to write off a twenty-five dollar uh, amount, but he is not did. able to do it. If I'm correct, uh, so if I understand the incident correctly, so what is happening is like uh, uh, up to amount twenty-five, he can write off. Above that, it should be sent to the approval. Correct. But when the activity is approved, uh, when the activity is approved, uh, or reject, um, or rejected, an error is occurring. You said Jacqueline, I mean, like blah blah blah, does not have permission to assign the item notification warning the items requires activity own permission. Can you show the error? Like, can you show the screenshot of this whether they might have that right? Yeah. Oh, 